Okay guys, so for those of us um, who maybe need a little extra help with the character map, I wanted to talk through it a little bit. So the first thing you're going to do is uh, come over here to where it says upcoming and pull open the assignment. Mine's going to look a little bit different than yours because I'm in teacher mode, but you'll download this. Now, I think, let's see. Yeah, we're going to have to download it. So you can also do edit in browser. Let's see if that works actually. It's just going to depend. Every computer is different. They all work differently. Um, let's see if it'll let me type. It, some of them would and some of them wouldn't. Yeah, so see, I'm just not having any luck like editing in here. So it's easier to just um, download it. So I'm going to click here again. Um, and then this time I'm going to download it. If you don't have PowerPoint on your computer or your phone, you can get that for free. I sent out that link yesterday, um, how to do that. And so then always make sure you click Enable Editing. Um, and here we have descriptions of each of the characters. So you kind of read through these and then use them and then the character descriptions on page IXXII in No Fear, Romeo and Juliet. And you can fill in the graphic organizer. So to get you started, um, we can do House of Montague on the left here. And then over here, that's going to be the House of Capulet. And then from there, you can figure out like who's related. So Lord and Lady Montague are obviously the head. So they're going to go here. And then Lady Montague over here. And Lord Capulet over here. And Lady Capulet over here and so on. So then you kind of figure out, okay, so what is this line going to? Like, this is probably their children, right? Mm, yes. Goodness gracious. Okay. So um, who is the son or, goodness, who's the son or daughter of Lord and Lady Montague, Lord and Lady Capulet? So you're going to go back here to kind of figure that out. And then it's almost like a logic puzzle, kind of trying to figure out who fits where, how everybody's related to everybody else. This is just kind of getting you familiar with these characters. Uh, don't worry about getting it exactly right. Just see what you can figure out. Once you're done, you'll have to save it. Um, my autosave is off. If yours isn't, it'll be saving automatically. So you want to save it make sure you know where it's at. And then you're going to come back to Edmodo. Um, and when you click view assignment, you'll see like a submit button. Mine's not going to show us that. I don't know what just happened there. Um, mine's not going to show us that. So that's okay too. Okay. And so that should be it for your character map. Let me know if you have any questions.